How are you all? We are fine, ma'am. As we all know, we are gathered here for maths quiz. Okay? We are going to have total three rounds, and each round we are going to tell you everyone specific rules. Okay? Yeah. So we are having four teams: team A, team B, team C, and team D. Are you guys ready? Yes, ma'am. Oh, so, round number one. We are going to start. Okay. The rules are: from each team, we are going to ask four questions. Okay. If you are not able to answer, then your question will be passed to the next team. Okay. For one question, you will get five marks. Or if another team is answering your question, means bonus question, they are answering, then you will they will get two point. Five half marks. Okay, clear everyone. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So team A, your first question is dash is called identity for the addition of rational numbers. You are having forty-five seconds. Dash is called identity for the addition of rational numbers. Wrong answer. Zero. Okay, zero. Okay, team B, right answer is zero. So team B will get two point five marks. Okay, team B, your question is multiplicity identity for rational number is dash. Okay. The right answer is one. So you will get five marks. So next question for team C. A simple closed curve made up of only line segments is called dash. Polygon. Polygon. Polygon is right answer. Okay. Next team D. Your question is. Sum of the measures of the external angles of a polygon is dash. The right answer is 360 degree. Next question for team A. Dash is a quadrilateral with a pair of parallel sides. The right answer is trapezium. Very good. Next team B, dash is a quadrilateral whose opposite sides are parallel. I repeat, dash is the trapezium. Parallelogram is the right answer. Next team C, your question is: There are eight red balls and four blue balls. What is the probability of getting red balls? There are eight red balls and four blue balls. Eight by twelve is the right answer. So, Team D, your question is: What is the when a die is thrown? What will be the probability of getting an even number when? A dice is thrown. What will be the probability of getting an even number? Three by six. Right answer. Three by six is the right answer. So next question for team A. What is the square of thirty-five? Twelve point twelve five. Wrong answer. Seven. Wrong answer. What is the square of thirty-five? Times times up. Okay, 
वन टू टू फाइव इज द राइट आंसर सो टीम डी गॉट बोनस पॉइंट टू पॉइंट फाइव ओके नाउ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज फॉर टीम बी वट इज द स्केयर ऑफ एटीन वट इज द स्केयर ऑफ एटीन What is the square of eighteen? First, ten seconds are left. Three twenty-four is right answer. So next question is for team C. Square root of forty-nine is square root of seven is right answer. Next question is for team D. Cube of even number is always a even. Even. Yeah, even is right answer. So next question is for team A. Marked price minus sale price is equal to dash. Discount. Discount is right answer. Next team B, your question is GST stands for. Goods and service tax is the right answer. So team C, your question is one centimeter square. cube sorry 1 cm cube is equal to dash milliliter 1 cm cube is equal to dash milliliter 1 milliliter is the right answer so your team d your question is 1 meter cube is equal to dash liter Thousand liter is right answer. Okay, now we are going to start round number two. In round number two, same. I am going to ask four questions from each team, but there will be a negative marking if you are not answering the question or your answer is wrong. Okay, minus one will be deducted from your score. Ready? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So first question is for team A. What is the surface area of cylinder? Two pi r into r plus r. Okay, two pi r into r plus h is right answer. Team A scored five marks in round one. Yes. Okay. Next question is for team B. Surface area of cuboid is. Six a square is wrong answer. So minus one. Yes. So next question is for team C. When base are same, but powers are different, the number are divided. Means a rise to the power m divided by a rise to the power n. What will be the solution? A rise to the power m divided by a rise to the power n. A power n to m plus one minus. A power m, m minus n. You spoke wrong answer. Minus one. First decide the answer. Take time then answer the questions. Okay. Next question is for team D. Name the two coordinates on the graph. Name the two coordinates on the graph. Y axis x. Right answer x axis and y axis. 5 marks to team D. So next question is for team A. A 
raised to the power 0 will be? One is the right answer. 5 marks to team A. Next question for team B. A raised to the power 1 is equal to. A is the right answer. So, they will score 5 marks. Next question is for. Next question is for team C. Who discovered 0? Who discovered 0? Aryabhat is right answer. So, team C scored 5 marks. Yes. Next question is for team D. What is the value of pi? 22 by 7. 22 by 7 is the right answer. Team D scored 5 marks. Next question is for team A. Angle greater than 180 degree but less than 360 degree are called. Reflex angle is right answer. Team A scored 5 marks. Next question for team B. Mathematical device that has beads. A mathematical device that has beads. Thirty seconds over. Be fast. A mathematical device that has beads. Forty seconds over. Time's up. So minus one for team B. Can you please check the answer? Abakas, in junior classes we draw one stands hundred and beats are there. We have to count them and name the numbers. Clear everyone? Yes, ma'am. Okay. So next question is for team C. Which is the only even prime number? Two is right answer. Five marks for team C. Okay. Next question is for team D. Roman number of 50. L. L is right answer. So team D scored 5 marks. Next question is for team A. What is the next prime number after 13? What is the next prime number after 13? 17. 17 is right answer. 5 marks for team A. Good. Next question is for team B. How many hours are there in a week? I repeat. How many hours are there in a week? One sixty-eight is right answer. Five marks scored by team B. Okay. Next question is for team C. All natural numbers and zero are called dash. Whole number is right answer. Five marks for team C. Okay, next question is for team D. Last question for this round. What is the sum of interior angles in a square? What is the sum of interior angles in a square? 360. 360. 
363 is right answer. So five marks to team D. So now we are going to start our round number three, final round. It will be buzzer round, okay? Yes. I'm going to ask you the questions. The team who knows the answer have to tell the first, okay? If your answer will be wrong, then minus one be deducted from your score. Clear everyone? Okay, ready? Yes, ma'am. So first question is, what is the formula of curved surface area of cuboid? Team A. Oh, uh, cuboid? Yes. Uh, 2H L plus B. Yes, right answer. 2H L plus B. B. Plus 5 to team A. So next question is, what is the area of equilateral triangle? Team D. Area of equilateral triangle. Be fast. Now you are deciding the answer. Okay, it comes to team A. Area of equilateral triangle uh, can be uh, that... Uh, Some of uh, all the angles. Wrong answer. Minus 1 from team A. And D also. Minus 1 from D also. Yes. Team C, you want to watch? 60. Wrong answer. Minus 1 from team C also. So next question is, what is the, the area of quadrilateral triangle is root 3 by 4 into side square. Okay, you answered wrong it. So next question is, what is the maximum value of probability? They are. Team D. You have to answer it quickly. What is the maximum value of probability? Team A. Uh, Ma'am, uh, total outcomes. But I'm wrong. Minus one from both the teams. Team B and C, you want to try? So, maximum value of probability is 1. Okay? So, next question. What is the value of 729 raised to the power 1 by 3? 729, 729 raised to the power 1 by 3. Next question is, what is the formula of probability? Team A. Wrong answer. Team D. Yes, right answer is favorable outcomes divided by total outcomes. So, 5 marks scored by team D. So, your next question is, which method is used to make the records or to observe the data? Team C, graph. Graph is right answer. So, team C scored 5 marks. Okay. Now, look at the marks. Round 1. Team A scored 10 marks. Team B scored 22.5. Team C scored 20. Team 